I consider the hearings a joke and they make no sense and that we will still be in the dark when the hearings are over. The voters uh, here will not know anything any more than what they've already seen. Many citizens spoke against this district when it was drawn in the first place. We traveled all across the eastern North Carolina to make comments about the fact that the district was not fair and that you were cramming black people into one, one spot. Elections going forth should not go forth, and you need to stop it and do what is right. And I hear about all the absentee ballots that have been sent out and have been sent in, which means that you have the names and addresses of those who have already voted by absentee ballot. Send them out to them again. They should not have to request them. Just send them to them again and let them vote once you have cleared up this matter. Uh, and stop blaming our Justice Department for accepting something that they probably didn't really look at to start out with. You all are the ones who sit, who drew this map and who made the first congressional district look like actually clown shoes. You act as if none of us have anything better to do today that we have to sit here and wait for the comments from people in other places and they have to sit and wait for us to make our comments when we all ought to be able to just make these comments in our certain districts and then be able to go home or go back to our work or whatever it is that we need to get done today. And we also here in this county need to get home before the rain that's falling out there freezes on the road again. Holding hearings in this manner is ridiculous. It's wrong. Redo the district lines and do the right thing. I guess that's all that I have to say. It's a mess. You made it. Clean it up.